Yo guys, it's Footmaster here. Welcome back to the channel. I just wanted to say Happy New Year to everyone. And guys, for this year, I want you guys to comment what you want me to do on the channel because recently I've been posting different videos, some player videos and stuff. But I'm obviously known for the explanations for promos. But yeah, let me know what more content you want to see because I do do similar stuff every time. But yeah, just let me know what you want to see and I'll be open to any suggestions. And also, stay tuned because the Twitch streams will be returning. So make sure if you haven't already, follow the Twitch. We'll be streaming regularly, trying to take over in 2024. But getting into today's video, we are going to be explaining the Versus promo, guys. It is coming to FC24 this Friday at 6 p.m. We're gonna be explaining what it is, how it works, some of the leaks as well. And yeah, if you are new to the channel, of course, hit the subscribe button, hit the like as well. It really helps out the channel. But getting into this video, with this promo guys i know a lot of people are confused by what the hell fire and ice is well basically ea do this thing where they flopped it when they last released it two years ago because they released two versions of the same player one fire one ice and the stats were only slightly different from each other the stats change was pretty pointless it was kind of uh, a pointless thing basically but with the pulisic svc that came out he had two cards a five star weak foot and a five star skill that was really nice because that's a significant change i hope ea do that just in the promo team because yeah the boosts and stuff were pretty poor as you can see this was the fire team nice players and whatnot but it was just the the, the difference from the ice cards was very unnoticeable i mean look at it guys there, there's literally no difference in the cards it was pretty pointless. And EA, the most notable thing from this promo was EA's stupid flop at a compensation. They accidentally compensated loads of people for no reason. And they gave them tradable compensation. So what that meant was all the cards that were valuable, like Valverde, uh, Jesus, and players like that, just crashed on the market. And everyone crashed, basically, because of EA. So that was quite funny. But as you can see, Valverde had this fire card, very nice card. And he had this ice card. The only difference was the defending and passing so as you can see the fire card had more defending and the ice had less defending but more passing and obviously the fire had less passing so the stat chains are pretty pointless jesus this one had less shooting i think it was and more pace so i think the ice one was better and with valverde i probably think that the fire one was better then we've got rashford who got a card he had one with three more dribbling and one with three less physical the fire was better in my opinion dribbling is more important but yeah the changes were pretty pointless but as you guys know we have got leaks already for this promo son is coming another son card can you believe it if he is not um 90 rated it's going to be so annoying we've got too many 89 sons already and an 88 we need a 90 rated son He'll be different to this card, which is probably his best item. He'll have the finesse shot like his player of the month does, which is absolutely crap. The best play style in an attacker, in my opinion. 90 rated Son. I th I made this concept where the fire was like this, and I think I made it so that one had more physical, the ice one had more physical, and less, I think it was passing, yeah, less passing. And the fire had more passing and less physical. Which one would you pick? Let me know down below. And make sure you follow my Twitter, TikTok, Instagram down below. I post this stuff before I cover it in videos. We've also got Kamavinga. He's very, very good. He can play left back. Let's hope EA boost him well though. Because he's only got an 82 rated card. He has got an Evolution, which is 87 rated. So hopefully he's 87 plus. And I made one for this as well. So Fire, I made him have less shooting. But he had more pace. Which one would you pick? I gave him quite a significant upgrade. I don't know if he able to do that. But a lot more pace on the fire, but a lot less shooting. And a lot more shooting on the ice, but less pace. Which one would you pick? But the biggest leak of this promo is Neymar Jr., ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe Neymar is getting an ice card. He's already got one of the best cards in the game. He's already gone down. I think even more than this. He's gone down, like, yeah, 2.6 mil now. That's absolutely ridiculous. They changed his play style because they didn't want to give uh this card uh tricks the plus because it would be too broken but he has rapid which is amazing as well five five one of the best cards in the game this card is probably going to be a plus one he's going to be so good i i reckon it'll be left wing as well we'll have to wait and see with that but everyone was hoping for a flashback name on it just didn't happen guys he is not getting 
a flashback because loads of leakers were tweeting that uh, a Neymar card was coming or a Brazilian with fireworks, whatever, and everyone was expecting a flashback. But an ice is cool, but let's be real, no one's packing this card, so we don't know what's going on there. There have been more leaks as well. I'll cover that probably Thursday, tomorrow, because the whole team will probably be leaked by then, maybe even tonight. Hopefully not, hopefully tomorrow. But yeah, that is how the promo works. So just to summarize, guys, with this promo, each player in it should be getting two cards one fire one ice i think one is later than the other i think the ice came after the fire so one team will drop and then they'll drop the next and hopefully the changes between the two players are much more significant than this because this was just poorly done it was really poor i really liked how the pulisic spc had a different weak foot and skill move that was sick but that was one spc and the card was kind of dead anyway so yeah let me know if you have any questions down below. I'm happy to answer them. Follow all my socials and make sure you like, subscribe. And as I said before, follow the Twitch. It's coming soon. And check out the other videos on the channel. But yeah, it's been Footmaster and I'm out. Peace out, guys.